Yeah. Now you would have thought a general rule, you know, as they say in English, once beaten, twice shy. You would have thought that people who have been married before, now when they enter into their second marriages, they are wiser. Just like somebody who has failed grade 10, you would have thought that since they went through the same syllabus in the past year, now that they are repeating the same syllabus, now they will be more successful. No, no, it actually doesn't work that way. It actually becomes the worse. The fact that you have been there before, it does not work to your advantage. In fact, it works to your disadvantage. Why? Why are second marriages and third marriages harder? Why are they harder? Number one, um, most of the time, the problem is not the other person, but it is marriage itself. Now, because most people, when the marriage is not working, the first thing that we think about is that you are the problem. The other one says you are the problem. But most of the time, it is the marriage itself. And as you have said earlier on, marriage is a complex institution. So many people enter marriage without preparation for marriage, without understanding what they're getting themselves into, without understanding how to navigate in this sea of marriage. And because of that, they give up. Oh, they can often can just as well blame the other person or blame themselves. But the biggest issue I have seen in, in the deterioration of marriage is lack of marital education. It's a lack of understanding of what marriage is and how to navigate marriage. In fact, that was Mashiri Ravangani, proudly brought to you by Living Power Ministries. You can find us at livingpower.org.za or on WhatsApp at plus 27 78 215 5737. Living Power, empowering mankind to unleash its full potential.